Hello listeners and welcome to Daily Current Affairs Quiz 1st September 2022. This is your RJ Priyanka and without any further delay we begin our today's quiz. So the first question for today's quiz is In which of the following state or union territory the Anangtal Lake which was declared a monument of national importance recently is located The correct answer for the question is the Anangtal Lake in South Delhi believed to have been built a thousand years ago has been declared a monument of national importance through a gazette notification by the Ministry of Culture Let's move forward to our second question. Where was a two-day conference on Indian minerals and metals industry held? The correct answer for the question is India's mining major NMDC in association with FICCI FICCI organized a two-day conference on Indian minerals and metal industry in New Delhi. Let's move forward to our question number 3. To promote and safeguard the intangible cultural heritage of India, which of the following company has partnered with UNESCO? The correct answer for the question is Royal Enfield and the United Nations Educational, Scientific and Cultural Organization UNESCO have joined hands to promote and safeguard the intangible cultural heritage of India. Let's move forward to question number 4. As the 14th Asian Under-18 Championship, Indian men's volleyball team won which of the following medal? The correct answer for the question is, Indian men's volleyball team has won the bronze medal by defeating Korea by 3-2 in the 14th Asian Under-18 Championship in Tehran, Iran. Let's move forward to question number 5. Gopal Jain and Dr Sivakumar Gopalan was appointed as the non-executive directors of which of the following bank The correct answer for the question is RBL Bank has appointed Gopal Jain and Dr Sivakumar Gopalan as non-executive directors on its board the private sector lender said in an announcement Let's move forward to question number 6 On September 2nd, 2022, who among the following will commission the country's first indigenously built aircraft carrier IAC Vikrant? The correct answer for the question is On 2nd September, Prime Minister Narendra Modi is going to commission the country's first indigenously built aircraft carrier IAC Vikrant. Let's move forward to question number 7. Who won the 2022 UNESCO Peace Prize? The correct answer for the question is Former German Chancellor Angela Merkel has been awarded the 2022 UNESCO Peace Prize. Now let's move further to question number 8. Who among the following was appointed as the managing director of IDFC Limited? The correct answer for the question is IDFC Limited announced that its board of directors has approved the appointment of Mahendra N Shah as the managing director MD of the company. Let's move forward to question number 9. In which of the following city the 4th edition of the India Clean Air Summit ICAS was held? The correct answer for the question is The 4th edition of the India Clean Air Summit ICAS was held in Bengaluru. The 4-day event was concluded on 26th August 2022. Let's move forward to the 10th and last question of today's quiz. In which of the following cities India's first 3D printed post office will be set up? The correct answer for the question is India's first 3D printed post office is coming up in Bengaluru and the entire construction will be completed within one month. So with this question we have now come to an end of today's episode of Daily Current Affairs Quiz 1st September 2022. Please stay tuned for more learning. This is your RJ Priyanka signing off. Thank you.